Hey everybody, I'm Lisa Roberry, your independent Scentsy consultant. Welcome back to my channel and happy Wax Wednesday, my friends, where around here we like to do something called bars to jars. That's where we will take a popular candle and we will compare Scentsy bars to either be a complimentary scent or maybe even close enough to maybe even be a dupe. So if you are someone who you are burning candles as well as enjoying your Scentsy bars, uh, but you want to have bars that are complementary to those candles, or maybe you're someone who you don't burn anymore and you know of a particular candle that you used to really enjoy and you want a wickless version. That is where this series comes in handy. And I know a lot of you guys have really been enjoying it. I myself really enjoy it as well. It's been so much fun. So let's go ahead and dive right in. This was probably one of the easier comparisons to do, but definitely one of my favorites. You guys already know what my favorite bars to jar is, but this one would definitely be a close second. And this is from Bath and Body Works. It is pumpkin pecan waffles. Oh my goodness. This one is a favorite for sure. I love this candle. I love all things pumpkin. <laughs> I am, I am one of those crazy pumpkin girls and Ugh, this is no different. This actually was a pretty easy one for me to find a comparison from Scentsy, but oh, it is so, so good. So if you love this candle as much as I do, listen up friends, especially if you are into your Scentsy bars because there is a really, really good comparison. Now, first let's go ahead and talk about this, the scent notes on, on this particular candle. So this is definitely a more bakery pumpkin scent, right? But you do have that nuttiness of the pecan that comes through that just adds like an added um, depth or richness to it besides that rich waffle note. And then the sweetness of the pumpkin comes through and it's just, it's absolutely beautiful. So love this. Uh, Bath and Body Works says that the fragrance notes are maple syrup, golden waffles, pumpkin spice, brown sugar. So, and if you are someone who, like, I'm really picky when it comes to maple fragrances because I don't, it tends to be too cloying. And this for me is not because you have, you have that added um, different kind of sweetness that comes through from the pumpkin and the brown sugar. And you have that little bit of like fall spice note, but there is that more like bakery warmth to this as well. So that's why I feel like the, the balance of this works really well. Now, do you have any suggestions on what you would think for Scentsy? I know for some of you had already picked up on this, but oh my goodness. So there are a lot of similarities with um, Scentsy's brand new scent, Almond Croissant. Some people think that this is an automatic dupe just by itself. Now, I don't think it's a dupe. There are a lot of similarities here, but you don't get that pumpkin note, but you definitely have that almond and you have the warmth of the croissant that's coming through. So you have that bakery element, but you're just missing that pumpkin. And if you love pumpkin, you gotta have the pumpkin, right? But if you were to only pick one scent, one bar, not do any mixing. These do pair really well together and I can definitely see why people do see or smell the similarities between the two. For sure. I do too, but I also still need that pumpkin. <laughs> I do still need the pumpkin. So I decided to mix one cube to one cube in the same warmer of almond croissant mixed with pumpkin cinnamon swirl. Oh my lands, you guys, this is so good. Uh, okay, you guys already know that this is my favorite pumpkin bakery scent, hands down, without a doubt, no hesitation. This is pumpkin cinnamon roll with a vanilla with a vanilla finish. It is so good, so sweet. It's so amazing. I love this for a pumpkin scent, but then when you mix it with this, it's pretty close. I would have to say it is a very, very close contender to the pumpkin pecan waffles. It's really close, you guys. I would have to say I kind of like this better um, just because there's just an added, there's just something, an added warmth or added sweetness between the two. It's so nice. And as you can see, I liked it so much. <laughs> I was like, I'm going to keep this pumpkin party going. I just loved it. It was so good. 
Uh, it's actually what's going downstairs right now and I am absolutely loving it. Oh, it's fantastic. I would definitely say that these are going to be the closest comparison mixture to Bath and Body Works pumpkin pecan waffles. Now let me give you the notes here for almond croissant as well as pumpkin cinnamon swirl. Um, and I know a lot of you have already picked up a bunch of the almond croissant. So if you already have this and you are wanting to do some mixing, try picking up the pumpkin cinnamon swirl and just like I said, one cube to one cube, it's mind blowing and life changing. <laughs> So almond croissant, Sensi says, a fresh baked croissant is made even more heavenly with cinnamon, sugar, and an infusion of almond. Absolutely, 100%, so good. But there's that cinnamon that is in the notes. It is a cinnamon sugar. It's almost undetectable, I will tell you. It is almost undetectable. It's more of that almond that's coming through and the warm, the warm bakery note. Um, the cinnamon sugar is just probably adding more warmth rather than spice per se. So don't let that turn you off because it is really good. So another one I probably could have tried, if you don't have almond croissant, you can probably even try doing Stroopwafel Delight mixed with cinnamon. It just now hit me. I would be interested to try that too. Um, one cube to one cube, Stroopwafel Delight and Pumpkin Cinnamon Swirl. That would be really good too. Love Stroopwafel Delight. Okay, let's talk about Pumpkin Cinnamon Swirl. This, I already told you, is my favorite here um, in terms of the pumpkin bakery scents. And I know a lot of people are, you're either like team pumpkin roll or team pumpkin cinnamon swirl. The differences between the two, Pumpkin roll is just a pumpkin cinnamon roll. That's what it is. This one is pumpkin, so pumpkin cinnamon swirl is a pumpkin cinnamon roll with an added like vanilla icing or like rich vanilla finish that I just love. It's so, so good and decadent. Sensi says pumpkin cinnamon swirl is fresh pumpkin garnished with cinnamon stick and a dollop of whipped icing. Once again, the cinnamon stick, it's definitely there, but it smells like it's a bakery cinnamon. It's that like cinnamon roll, not like, yeah, like super red hot cinnamon in your face. It's definitely there, it's definitely detectable, but I like it and appreciate it. And that's where the added sweetness from that vanilla finish kind of tones down the cinnamon, but it's perfect. It's so, so good. So this, was a definite winning combination in this week's Bars to Jars for Bath & Body Works Pumpkin Pecan Waffles. Let me know if you have tried this combination. Let me know if you've tried a different wax combination for this candle. I would love to know your thoughts. If you haven't given this little mixture a try, definitely give it a try. Let me know your thoughts. This is amazing and I definitely, I love the two on their own, but oh man, together, it is not disappointing, I will tell you that much. So thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know in the comments down below what your thoughts are. Like I said, if you had any other recommendations for different scent mixes, but this is a winner in my book. So give it a try. Let me know uh, how you like it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new, please subscribe. Otherwise, I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.